there's the giant portal in the middle. What does that mean? Say that again. To go into it? Yep, use your. Bunch of cheers pop up or something? And one did. What did it say? Probably telling you to beat the game or something. So this just gets a little corny. Hmm. Did you know what he did wrong? I don't know. There's still enemies spawning, I guess. What floor are you on, or what does it say? The high peak the same thing. Oh, maybe I didn't kill him. Maybe the guy was just invisible. There's two oh. bosses there. I swear to God, I killed both of them, but I might be crazy. I don't know, dude. What up? Uh, do you still have 10,000 points in your, uh, tome? Huh? Do you still have 10,000 points, like, when you go to your new, your, uh, A sets for tome? No. Why? Why does it say you have now? 12,500? I thought it was point cap, what? Oh, yeah, yeah, right. It can go over that because of the 100%. I'm asking the wrong person then. Nikki, what does it say you have? Are you doing the light thing? What? Oh, I thought you did. Oh,
much dough they got, dude. I didn't see if that's in that earlier. Yeah. Oh, I should say that one just last difficulty. Yeah, maybe. Maybe he wants to see what his progress is right now. Oh, okay, fair enough. I, to be honest, I would like push one every five seconds. Like any time any other treatment, do a treatment, I right, push. It just seems inefficient. Can't be idle in the main and keep my time on. It's all the same. I mean, instead of having one and then getting a drone that we can. What the fuck? The boss put a stone wall on top of himself. What? I just got stoned. The first time. But... Yeah, it will eventually go away, or you can break through it if you have a, uh, a, a big pool. I have a tall part. He's invisible. Alright, kill him. Done. Sacrifice arm to save the world, you'll never be forgotten. Madness difficulty. Sick game. Alright, let's check out this guy that you wrote. The game just crashed almost like that. Holy fuck. I just signed into Steam without having an attached account or without making one. No, I don't think you need to make an account. Okay. You said that you, you don't think I need to make an account? I think you do need to make one. And then you need to like verify it too. Uh. Interesting. 
interesting. Yeah, this has my old shit. I should log out and make a new account. Also fucking sucks to fight against those AI. Please switch to your game now and confirm. You have to be in a uh, level. In a level? No, you just have to be. Just look at the guide, man. I am looking at the guide. Yeah, it says when you click on Princess Games, then you have to be logged in on your character, and you get a pop up that says, Would you like to push the seat? Gotcha. gotcha. Look at that, then. It's level 8. Vision under divination. Level 8. I said 8. You have to be, you have to get the previous one. And it didn't push me all the achievements from the previous difficulties for some reason. if you make a new account, it takes a while for it to upload. Okay. That's fine then. Yeah, it gave me one achievement when I pushed it. I just made a new account. Yeah, but you have all the previous ones. Did you make an account? Is what you were saying? No. Oh, okay. I can load the old saves, though. 
Yeah. Yeah, like going through the speed run, you're not going to get that much because you're just going to get what you already have. It's when you start doing side quests and stuff, that's when you pop that big one. I didn't unlock the arena. There's a dungeon um, on the west side of the map. Dungeon on the west on this and uh the second map or the at the first or second map? Is it south of Dirth? It is Dirth. Um, so in Dirth, oh, uh, fucker. you will kind of die inside Dirth uh, at the top of the map of Dirth. Um, so you'll say, hey, let me talk to you. And you talk to him. He's like, hey, you want to fight in this arena? You'll fight the guy that's going to unlock the arena. And that's the separate mode where you get to set the save file inside Dirth. Separate campaign, I guess, if I were to call it, where you just get the arena. And you can go fight that. Already did. Oh, okay. Do you have uh, madness? Yeah. If you're not 20 minutes to get madness, I didn't really need it to, but yeah. You don't really need to ask any questions or learn anything about the game if you're just going for the cap. You can literally just do fucking anything at any point and That's you'll hit it. Yeah, for once you have madness and you start your madness run, it's literally you have to play all the content in the game essentially, so you might as well just start exploring and having fun. And the only thing is you gotta watch out for those two dungeons where they might spawn clones. That's the only thing you have to worry about. Everything else is just fucking, you know, pop your way along. Even if that does happen, you can probably still find them. Just like restart and get back to that point. Yep. Shouldn't even take you more than like one life to hit the fucking cap. Yeah, once you have madness It's got these 60 woods in the arena. Great. Large ball. 
fucking Ozo. And Volcano. Let's fail the just call. How do you fail a just call? Oh, no. What the fuck? What? 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 He lost all his money. What the fuck? Yeah, yeah. It's very difficult because you still have trucks that you can send to do on a all you have to do is just send them to like restock a town. Like even if the town like they bring a hundred times, you know, it's like eight times, they're obviously you can't make money off of every trip. Yeah, I don't see how he lost money. He lost the hundo. He probably spends all of his money on the industry, he's not realizing that he doesn't need to be out of here. Because the industries can get expensive if you really just want to get all these and there's uh, one town right now that is broken that can't get the hundo. So no one will have the hundo until uh, Sakata gets back next week. New teleportation. It is uh, King Ross and uh, Blue Axe Piper. Apparently uh, the, the requirements are doubled, literally. So like, they're actually almost tripled. Basically, instead of having one icon for silicon, there's like three icons. His money went negative. What? Uh, you can do that because there are costs to being thought. Nice. To being in there, and you should be able to pull yourself out of it just by getting a certain amount of job. Go play logistical. I can't do it. I'm so close to finishing the line. I just keep putting it off. Yeah, yeah it's a good one to just sit down and hammer through. Yeah, but it's like really boring, I guess. I ordered the hundo in in um, the scam. What game? Tell him. Tell him. Uh, hundred and back, right? It's not that bad. What's Hulk though? mode? I would say the worst is probably uh, the endless mode. Oh, yeah, okay. Endless mode and a few of the kind of funky achievement ones where you have to like kill a guy but also not kill this guy while also. I can't. Like, I was trying to. Calling another guy. I was trying to macro arena but I can't. So that's whatever. Because like one of the mobs is like a skitter. Like, like they'll run away from you, so I have to keep chasing him, and you can't macro that. I was like, maybe I could, and I was like, once I found that mob that just kept running away from me like a little bitch, I couldn't do anything about it. Fuck, dude. <laughs> Did he delete <laughs> he deleted it? I deleted it. What <laughs> was it? <laughs> Uh, I mean, what was it? You can just say it. it unless it's really I think bad. he said Festus is shit or something. He said, I'm gonna make Festus suck on my dick, dude. Oh. Who the fuck said that? <laughs> oh shit, I'm sorry, Falcon. What? Unarmed? I'm fucking doing- I'm doing the arena unarmed. Okay, 
what he's sticking the air for. He's doing this for you. <laughs> I like seeing the numbers change a lot. Oh, he's like two, yeah. six, six. Alright, I'm taking a break. I need a break. This game is fucking killing my eyes. Fucking three ninety nine pending. Wait, hasn't you? Didn't you return it? I just went to it today. Oh, uh, what the fuck? Why'd you wait so long? I don't know. I was gonna return it yesterday, <laughs> but and I had the tab open, and then I, I went just to never got through it. And I came back and I fucking loaded it. That shit, dude. Three ninety nine pending. Code's legit. Even. Gaben doesn't give up his money easily. He gave in bucks. Steam bucks. Right, I'm gonna make my character a wall star real quick for a free 50. I don't think it's live yet because the patch didn't go up yet. Time flies when you're playing Tome. Such a fun game. <laughs> oh, fuck, dude. Was there some new DLC coming out for Tome? Do they, do they ever have plans on fixing the Rogans, or is it as a zone in the game? The what game? Tome. Tome. Yeah, there's, like, intense, like, like, Wait, patches. Wasn't he now. making a new DLC or something? I swear I thought he was. I found out the hard way that, like, if you bring resources into a big city, they decay if you don't finish it. Correct. If you yeah. get it to yellow, it decays slower. Yeah, I've been working on Canberra for a solid hour before I realized that. Ouch. Yeah, the flower shop can be near Canberra, but then the world is what takes forever. What you can yeah. do is you can, uh, get your trucks filled up with gold, um, bring them over, and then when they get close to it, uh, press the power off on them, and that just parts yeah. them. And once you have enough that would equal more than 73.6, then you will get, um, to power them all on. Okay. That way there's, like, almost no decay, because they're all going to reach at the same time. Just park them on top of each other. That's what you do for a lot of towns if you don't feel like building the industry right next to it or if you don't want to build the industry next to it. Yeah, I haven't unlocked any industries yet. Or, yeah.
down 5,000. Like negative 5.7K in the red. Oh, that's far. He was not intentionally trying to go lower. Trying to hit the negatives. Oh damn! So you know why it costed seventy five dollars, Auburn, for that mouse? Hmm. They gave me a one day shipping. Oh. One day overnight shipping. Nice. For what mouse? Uh, my Razer Death Adder Chroma. Uh, it's under warranty. Rip, dude. No, I'm getting it refunded. It's just warranty. He did not... uh, expedited RNA, where you yeah. put a hold on your credit card for the full thing, and they hold it until you send it back. And uh -huh. if you don't send it back, they charge you. Well, I'm gonna send it back like the day I get the fucking mouse, so it's not like it matters. It only has to go to Irvine, so that's literally one day. Because it goes to the headquarters of Razor, so it doesn't even have to go anywhere. Irvine, Tejas? Irvine, California. I mean, you can say that about Logitech. Never buy Logitech products. Just That's apply true. X to Y yeah. here. The only thing that Logitech has is good wireless mics. Corsair for life. I, Corsair keyboard's good. I hate Corsair mics. I've owned Aww. them before. I just, They're they different. They don't fit my hand. You know what I want in a mouse? I want a I want a fucking little tiny fan and a mouse that cool my hand off. Pretty sure they make sweat in your hand. Yeah, that's be nice. I my hands sweat. I don't think I can ever change the new Zowie I have, which is perfect. Yeah, you Zowie kid. I tried the the FK1 from Zowie. It's like the really thin mouse. It was awful. I've had a lot of mice over the years. Like I've had a Rocat. Or cat clone. That's I think European. those aren't that bad because you can get them for like twenty bucks. Like I got it. I got it. I got it like fifty bucks, like way back when. But like it lasted like two years, and then it just started falling apart. And then the right click actually snapped off and broke. Did my razor last for six months. Uh, just depends, dude. My buddies also lasted like around the same time. It just depends on how much you use it, though. Honestly, like if you use it like daily, every day for like you know ten, fifteen hours a day, you're gonna it's gonna wear the fuck, wear the you know wear it the fuck out like sooner than later. Hey, what are you Dude, no, Zowies will never wear out. Okay, no, ever. Look. Look. Okay, enough about your razor shit, dude. I've got a point zero 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 two gram fucking Zowie, custom made in Italy, dude. I play on a fucking 24 foot table the entire thing is a super slick fucking cotton mouse pad okay i play on a crt monitor 14 inches i play it fucking 480 by 640 dude i play it sensitivity point negative 200 000 i've 
I actually have to go the opposite direction to move the way I want to go. That's how fucking low my fucking sensitivity is, dude, because that's how I get the fucking flick shots, baby. I got gamer blinds, so I don't get the fucking sun in my eyes messing up my fucking shit, dude. Got a poster of Hiko on my wall. Covers the entire wall because he's that fucking fat. Wow. Get fucking wrecked. Oh, uh, gamer blinds are an actual thing. <laughs> Did you Google it? Oh god, why would you do that? <laughs> you Google gamer blinds. Albert's like, what? Is he trolling with it? What the oh, fuck? It's it just blinds with like a gaming pattern, not like. <laughs> no, it's not I found Blitz is blind. Get wrecked. What is that? Uh, the yeah. Is it just black or is there a Pac-Man controller on the other side? Animated. Anime. It was just like a naked anime girl on the other side for everyone else to see. <laughs> Yo, dude, Hobbs, you won't believe this shit, man. But the other day, my fucking dad, you probably haven't heard of this. He's getting um, his house painted. And I googled it. It's like fucking... It's like CSGO fucking weapon skins, but like for a house, like in real life, dude. <laughs> I didn't know this shit fucking existed, man. Dude, I know, right? Fucking wild, bro. You know, did you see Mr. fucking Falcon's picture of, of the 333 things? <laughs> At your mom's house? 90210? <laughs> Beverly Hills, baby. Oh my god. Okay, this guy, this guy's a fucking class of all his own. I almost bought one of those, but it's just because it was three dollars, but I'm like, eh, nah. Yeah, but uh, all the things that he listed now, $3. all the fucking right, products uh, that yeah, Sarah yeah. Hintz sells, is you can't buy them. Either. Yo, can you keep it down, guys? My gamer blinds are just a little, letting a little light in. I'll laugh my ass off if he gets like the, the box and just two pictures, one of the mouse and one of the mouse pad. I'll, I will fucking be dead. That is some scummy. God, the spirit sphere grind. So I'm just gonna reuse the same box that they sent me the mouse in. That's a good idea. Yeah, that works unless they over like. Should be some giant fucking box, and that's a waste of money for shipping. No, they're, 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 they pay for the shipping. On the way back? Yeah, on the way back. Wow, they must know their products are shit. They give me a two day return back shipping. No, it's just it's just general to cover both coming and going. Yeah, I mean, not all comp not most companies don't do that. Logitech did it for me. I mean, fuck, Logitech even went a step further and didn't even want my head, the, the broken head, so they just sent me a new one. I like how it says RMA return reason blank name. I don't think it can just be pictures. I should have RMA my mouse when the warranty was about to end just to get a fresh one. Yep. Yeah. Smart way to do it. This is good until 2018. I should have done that online and sold it. I already made my keyboard and they sent me an RGB one back. I was like, fuck yeah. What? Yeah. Hold on, I gotta make some coffee to spill on my keyboard or anything. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I had a K95 and then like, I already made it because like the cable was weird because I was using it on a bed and like, and it stopped like connecting properly. It was like this... moving all the time. And I sent it, sent it back and then they're like, here you go. And I opened it up and I'm like, RGB. So this warranty is good until 11-7-2018. 
So, yeah. This is Mouse. Rex again, I'll just get another one. Did I ever say that I, my dad bought a, a K70 with blue switches in it, and they sent him three K70s with red switches? Three? Three. What? Did he just resell the extra one? Uh, we're using them as backups in case something happens. Yo, the K70 is good. good. I got the rapid fire one RGB with uh, Cherry MX uh, Ghosts. It just sounds like a fucking waste of money right there. What? Why? Is there something I'm missing? You guys just like return it at the near the end of the warranty? I mean, I didn't, I didn't do it intentionally. I, I just put it off because my two boards like somewhere. stopped working, and then I just used a shitty one for a while. And then, like, a year later, I'm like, I should probably really get a replacement. And then I send it back, and they're like, here's a brand new RGB keyboard. Yeah, like, if, you know, cool. if you know your warranty's ending in a few months, you should just, like, make up some BS excuse that your fucking muscle's breaking. Unless it actually is. Complain on Reddit. I have to send you a ton of free swag. <laughs> but, yeah. And it's like, there's no customer protection law from the country I live in, so there's no or anything. Uh, you know that guy? So the one I have, uh, Hobbs, is the K70 RGB rapid fire train MX speed. Yeah, that just sounds like a fucking waste of money. Why is it sound like a waste of money? It sounds expensive as hell. Yeah, it is. The more buzzwords you add, the more expensive it gets. It is. It's, the, it's literally a soft line keyboard you can buy. Yeah, and it functions exactly the same as my $60 one. Um, I think I spent one point on my time, but that was like. Well, I mean. I bought the K95 start, like four years ago. Hops, when you start getting in the more expensive rings, like, that's where you can, like, get into the duckies and fucking, like, pokers and shit like that. That's why they cost so much, because it's for, like, the build of the keyboard. Duckies cost a lot. But, I mean, it's, duckies aren't the only brand that makes 60% keyboards. No, I know, but duckies are still really good. I feel like I've never tried one myself, but I feel like it might be a little bit over the, the Ducky, like, Euro keyboard, the special edition ones, I mean, those are just, like, for cosmetic, but they're yeah, also really good. I played fan games on a Ducky, and then he bought a K70, and he's like, this K70's way better. Mm. Might just be because it's different, though, honestly. I mean, yeah, if you own any keyboard, you're gonna find some faults with it eventually, so. Keyboards last for fucking ever, dude. Like, I had that Razer Black Widow, like the, the original blue one. I had that for like four years. It's lasted. There's nothing wrong with the keyboard. Brothers had his for a while. The newer ones are shit, though. Like, the, the old school, like, Razer Black Widow is really good. Ones. The new ones are made with Razer's Chinese ones. You don't have to get their fucking car. Oh, what do you have against the Chinese, Hob? You make too much stuff to make stuff. Hobbs, you don't. You don't you don't have to get Razer's mechanical switches though. That's optional. No. Razer Razer has their own mechanical switches. They have green and uh, green and orange. You don't have to get them. You you would have to buy an older model. Of you, no, I'm saying. Link me to a 20, 2016 Black Widow with Cherry MX switches. What is an orange? That's their special kind. Oh. And the rates are limited. Only edition shit. I want some greens just to like type shit on. Apparently, Apollo was telling me that he had a 60% keyboard with MX Clears. The fuck is a clear? MX Clears I can't, is. I can't remember. MX Clear is basically MX Speed. What is that? What does that mean? So MX Speed is basically. A Cherry MX Red, but then you actually, like, it goes, the execution point is a little bit, uh, that's one of my ear marks. No, actually it's lower. Oh, it's seeing a rapid fire rate. Yeah, it's lower than a red. Like, reds are 2 millimeter and the speeds are 1.2. Yeah, so it'd be higher. Close no, 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 it's like, it'd be, like, closer to the keyboard. But that takes longer to press, right? Yeah, but, like, you can, like... Like, go really fast. It bottoms up quicker. Impressive. Oh, I see what you mean. Yeah. Yeah, so reds are like, or speeds are like reds, but they're like in between reds and blues. But they're just better, I guess. Like, better for gaming. 
Hey, hey, you know the analog game. keyboards? Huh? Seen the analog keyboards? No. Companies are trying to make them. Be interesting. Yeah, speeds have 1.2 millimeters and then reds are 2. So that's the difference in the execution point. This means that it bombs out faster when you press the key. I first got this keyboard, I was making so many typing mistakes though. Because you have to get used to it. Because I, I, was, I was on blues originally. If you can imagine going from blues to, uh, <laughs> to, to speeds, it's, it's quite a change. Just like blue. I mean, that was just the keyboard I had the Razer, Black Widow, original blue, like 2015 or whatever. That's what I had. And then I went from that to this. Yeah. I think it, like if I if I wanted to like get different switches, I'd probably get um, reds. Speeds are nice, but they're just it's too many like misclicks. You can't go wrong with red, dude. What does the Razer Chroma use? The Greens or oranges? Razer shitty ones, so don't even bother. Yeah, apparently you can't actually get. Different color, uh, different freaking things. Apparently you can't. Stupid. But you could. Yeah, you're stuck with green or orange. It's fucking dumb. You have to buy the older models. It's also retarded how that Razor Black Widow, um, Chroma is literally the number one bestseller on keyboards. Oh, that's for Mac gaming keyboards. Okay. That doesn't make any sense. Are greens and oranges inferior? Inferior, they're just different. They're lower quality. Fairy MX is the standard. It's different. And Razer cheaped out, and they thought, oh, we can make switches in China for way cheaper. So they did that, and then they branded it as their own cool switch. They also, they also have Razer Black Little X Tournament Edition Chroma. It's a slap fucking word on that. No, other edition just the like Fairy percent no, uh, tournaments literally like uh, key, uh, 10 kilos and stuff like that. Also, also metal construction too, though, which is nice. The Nintendo Switch is pretty terrible too. <laughs> that fucking sound, dude, was killing my ears. Holy shit. <laughs> I love that video. This private pilot guy who just joined is like rank 60. On these stats. He's serious? Yeah. Look how many hundos he has. Got any good ones? What we got here? The VIP? Bit yeah. Yo, that, that's a new idea for rank on, on one of our pals. What? VIP. And how do you do that? Uh, top 100 on 100 pals. Not a bad idea. So much work. Not really. I don't think that would be that much work. I mean, ranks are changing all the time, though. So. Yeah, but I mean, like, top you have to keep way too much. Top fifty. Everybody 50? here would have. It. I would say top. Everybody top here would have it. I mean, top ten is pretty much like. Yeah. Top ten is not. Just have a, a new, a new role, professional achievement hunters, and make it Kevin only. Oh my god. Let's just say Please. the cheap best. Was this guy Pile? Private Pile? He only has 208 games, 100%. Say hi to him. Only. Only. Oh god, man. Oh, you have hard. actually plays hard games. I have played Oh right boy. <laughs> What's wrong with that? Where's the hard game? Where's the hard game? Dude, Sly Fox. That Sly Fox Cooper dude? I saw his fucking his pie chart. His pie chart's higher than mine. I fucking should have seen this one. Yeah, he's got he's at 88% <laughs> trivial. 88% trivial. You can't beat that. You, you can't just start all my shit is trivial. When Bork unprouded a Danky, it showed 0% trivial. <laughs> For some reason. 
No, because no, Danky has, has the hard hard games. You're still gonna have trivial achievements for Yes, I'll get his profile, that's why. I'm at a solid 1.5% epic. It just means his profile has been fired for like a couple months. I've been playing a lot of like Payday 2 and TF2. Like, it should yeah, be 2.2% epic. Yeah, I'm hard. It's, it's good. I'm hard for only like 40 levels. Still yeah, better than I have. It's like four times as epic as I am. And with this logistical, it's gonna be even more. I don't know if logistical is gonna get epic. I feel it's gonna be a lot of uncommons and rares. Aren't they planning on adding like four areas? If they do, I feel they should make a new game. Or maybe a DLC that's separate to the game. I don't know. Fucking watermark, dude. So much more prominent on like the bigger size of the picture. You should Photoshop it a face in the top of the box. <laughs> That's not what that would be. I wouldn't even know how. What I want to know is why was this image watermarked? You're almost the same rank as the pink rock park. I'm like, I'm like 2200 or something. Yeah, oh, never mind, JK. I got a bunch of that face. Oh, baby. Give me the points. Give me the points, so give them to me. Okay. I need to fucking break this 200 nonsense. Then between like 201 and 205 for like a week or two. I have 0.59% epics. I have 907 points in foam. Not bad. I'm gonna get at least 100 today. I wanna play some other games though. 907 points on Tom is literally like. All of your combined points? No, it's 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 almost 10% of my of my space stat points. <laughs> nice. <laughs> literally 10%. Just double your whole thing with just Tom when, when you're done. I mean, yeah, actually, it would. I still haven't done Tom. I haven't done any really high point games. My highest point game is Lazy Pixels. I mean, I got 900 points just today from Tom, so I should skip up like a fucking rank set of, out of the 2000 zone. Should pull me out of the 2000 zone. What would I even be interested in playing? Tom? I mean, yeah, it's home. It's gonna happen at some point. For at least yeah, half. or you have, you have the DLC. You can do that in like an hour. DLC. That's like 4,000 points, 5,000 points. Age of Empires 2? Mm, I don't have the DLC for that yet. Yeah, you can't do that yet. I technically don't own the game, I just have it on share with the first DLC. DLC. Yeah, you can do the cheesies though, on, on AOR and be okay. Be nice boost. Yeah, like, none of these high point games appeal to me much. Ninety nodes in this stupid exploration.
Looks like a duplicate of the werewolf. Some DC points. I would do Book of Demons when I get to finish because that game's pretty sick. This one game has 25 broken out of 73 cheats. It's fucking terrible. Does that knock you still still here? Should have a new channel. Damage when I break on my Titan. Yeah, well, that's the trick of that long. Fuck. Fuck. That's a fucking ASMR. Long actually unlocked the skill from fighting. Because it's like the sixth skill. Wait, you can only lock, lock it from fighting? fighting? Yeah, like. You have to open it up by having the level and then you need to unlock it by like fighting or buying an unlocker. Wait, what, what, what kind of unlocker? Like, ability unlocker? Wait. You mean like a fractal? Or? No, like an ability unlocker. What is it called? Uh, let's see if I have any. I found you, I found your ASMR video. Uh, is that on? I saw it. An Stranger? Oh, I have one of those. Yeah, but that unlocks the last anyway. Yeah, alright, what do you, what do you need then? Besides the Stranger? Yeah, just gonna change it later. Should I use it on my Titan? I mean, it just unlocks one of the skills. You have to have the level, though. I thought the level unlocks the skill, though. No, the level lets you lets you be able to learn it. Oh fuck. Is Mobius Day on fucking water? Lagoon? I am so fucking stoked. Getting so many new ones today. No, oh, I'm gonna, gonna do it. Let's do it. I need to calm the fuck down. I have too much sugar. Like, way too much caffeine in my blood. Thanks. 41 more nodes than I have under I'll do it today. Yeah. You know what this is? Yeah, that's the point of Moby Day. Yeah. Yeah, Kevin was like, yo, it's Mobius Day. I'm like, uh, it's not though? <laughs> he's like, and, and he plays on Korean server. Yeah, I didn't get, I don't understand like why he's doing that. Because that's how it assigns people sometimes. Yeah, but you can get out of that though. Just like, it's all the game. Yeah, but you have to restart. Just, you, you can just save your code, what? I'm pretty sure you have to restart all together. No, you can see, you can see that code that they give you. There's a code. So you can take the code across save data. Or he, what you can do is you can pop that save data on his phone or his tablet and then just basically restart and then just I mean, that that data probably back. saved on Korean servers though. Oh, fuck. Okay, you're probably right then, never mind. Oh, day one patch for Wildlands. Let's see what they did. Several multi GPU graphical corruptions. Cool. Yeah. Always get fennel and swamp. <laughs> and the AI always does this whiff hit thing. I love fennel on 
swamp though. Like, always gonna hit the fucking. Yeah, if they ever, if they add those co op juice and plus plus and ground in the game. It's just play it like two people on the call? No. Did Mark do it? I mean, I did it on the first row, but like, it gets way harder. Um. Uh, Okay, then. Someone with like thousands of hours in the game said it would probably take him another few thousand hours to be able to do all the co op by himself. He's a pussy. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> Who said that? That was what? Zach, I think. Uh. What game is it not fun? Let's watch the stream. Spirit Sphere. Sounds, Sounds like, like a piece of shit. It's actually a really great game. It's no, just a bad yeah. hundo. Oh, this game. No one's actually hundoed it yet. It could be first. So, so do you like this kind of game? Yeah. Love our game. So this game just came out, by the way. Win Jammers. Yeah, I know, dude. Trust, trust me. I was on that shit. I will fucking destroy people at fucking dish jammers. Got so much good cheese for Spirit Sphere. What do you want for the 8%? I'm always going for the 8%. Yeah, you should try out, you should check out those jammers and see if you like it. See if I do, guys. I do like it. Yeah, I played the beta. Like a lot. You got destroyed by some, like, fucking wood jammers professional. I game, so fuck them. What do you mean they took your game? Yeah, I had the beta. It was in my library, and then they're like, oh, gone now. Yeah, because the beta's over. Some betas let you keep it. I mean, to be fair, it's a $15 game that's a multiplayer-focused game that's probably not going to have a lot of players at launch. There's one achievement for multiplayer. But still, I'm just saying, like, it's not going to have a lot of players. Oh, there's a new game coming out? Holy shit. Yeah, you just boost grind it with somebody. That's all you got to do. It's 50 games. Unless it's ranked and you're just fucked. That's not my point. I don't know. I mean, a lot of multiplayer games don't have people playing them like this game. I mean, then I could just find somebody that has it and just boost with them if he needs to it online once. Oh, snap. The Marco and the three things up. Ghostblade HD. What is it? Oh, okay, that's what that is. That was 10? Really? What oh, comes out tomorrow? Danmaku Unlimited 3. Himiko comes, comes out, out tomorrow. tomorrow. That's that, that game from that same dev that uh, Larry bought that uh, game from. Uh, Alright, the only thing that's not working for me is Filthy Rich, collect 10k coins, so I might try to reset my game data. Sword of the Fireheart comes out. I don't know. I think, I don't know. It says on um, early access. Holy fuck, captains are noxious. Oh god, a lot of artifacts in the game. Fuck. How are they not done making hidden object games? Never gonna be done, dude. Jesus Christ.
Was that Chosen 2 supposed to come out two days ago? I'm not familiar with that. March 6th. That would be two days ago. What's that Chosen? I don't know which it is. Uh, RPG Maker game? Oh. Are you kidding me? It undid my achievements. What do you do when you're too bad to develop a decent game? You just make a sexy one RPG make. Oh my god, dude. Just the ultimate worst thing ever happened to me. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> oh, it's so bad I can't even say it. What did you do? In game or in real life? In this game. So I got every achievement except for one. Um, I get that one. There was one achievement for collecting 10,000 coins and it wasn't working. And there's no like counter for it. And there's an option in game to like erase your data. So I thought, okay, if I restart my game, you know, and like unlock or the 10k coins again maybe it'll oh, work oh god i see it so i unlock or i erase my data and it fucking reset every achievement also wait, wait oh, oh, it's oh, a oh, weird oh. achievement it took away wait, all of his achievements what spirit spear yeah um, that just there goes 10 hours of grinding right there and 10 hours of playing the game that's fucked up rest in peace dude that is fucked up, up. I can't believe the, the guy to death did that. Wow. wow. That sounds so shitty though. It's funny though, because like in your your tracker, it's like it shows you already won, like you already beat single player ten times. Oh fuck! Does that mean he can't actually get the achievements anymore? I don't know. He beats matches. Happen, maybe. If he beats a match and doesn't get the achievement, oh shit, that's gonna be fucked. Dude, that's dumb. dumb. He'll have to put that deal in to be able to be able to lock it or something. Like, the mod or something like that. I mean, I don't think he'll, he'll be able, able to unlock them with Sam if that's what you're saying. Uh, oh, oh yeah, yeah because, because it's all on client side, side or whatever. Is that what you mean? I mean, yeah. it's it's no, I think that the, the data, data is, yeah, the data, data is stored on there, and, and so you can really change it. Some shit though. Never reset the data ever. I, I only know of a couple games that do that. You mean like Snowman? No. No, I mean like it just, instead of reset the level, it's just reset the game. Yeah. Yeah. Shit. Check out the name Into of the, the zone and and uh Moby the Senate. Kill me. Why what's what's so bad about that? It's not bad. It's nostalgic. Mithran Triglands? Hell yeah. I'm not following what game that's from. Oh Fantasy Eleven. Oh, okay. Mithran. <laughs> that's why Synax like kill me. I think he wants to die because of spirits here. Oh, yeah, that too. He's probably hitting up the dev right now. He's like, dev, fix this. I mean, there's 
it's really not. They could really do to fix it unless yeah. the data is still stored there somewhere. Maybe. Well, 